it isn't just, we've been talking about perfumery, we've been talking about music and painting and so on, but the sport, the whole of sport is a whole world of pleasure available to us. And I, uh, I've always tried to uh, respond to the wonderful complexities and novelties of life. So that for me, uh, finding a new form of sport uh, is fascinating. And there are some very strange sports, uh, which uh, very few people know about, and I'm always looking out for them. And um, the Mayans- Like cricket? Have, <laughs> I, <a> cricket. Like <laughs> cricket? <laughs> I have no idea what they're doing. <laughs> no, but, but the Mayans had a, had ball court, a huge, uh, in pre-Columbian times, so these huge ball courts where they had uh, uh, magnificent um, audiences watching them play their ball game, the special ball game, which was a very strange one. And then, of course, the chariot racing was was very big, and uh, um, the the blues and the greens in ancient uh, times had a huge uh, competition between the two lots of chariot supporters, uh, and there were chariot hooligans. Uh, so uh, the the the, um, uh, the whole history of sport is fascinating. We haven't touched on that, but there there are so many different aspects of life. And so much to find. And, and the one thing I'm sad about at 92 is that I've got so many more questions to ask and I haven't got much time left to ask them, but I'm still doing it. And I'm still, uh, I'm keeping my brain uh, oiled, if I can use that expression. And uh, I'm trying to avoid um, losing interest in novelty and uh, losing the sense of the marvelous uh, and the sense of surprise because that's what makes life worth living. Well, I I have a million more questions for you, so I know how you feel in a way. Um, and you you are amazing to me. You you are marvelous to me. You have opened up this whole. I, I can't even I can't even express to you how grateful I am that I finally really discovered you you know I, I, I met you in the 90s on the show and I've told that story a hundred times where at the end you're saying you know, you know the, about the lying you know <laughs> the, the indicators that the human being is lying is they put their hand near their mouth and you know and you ended the show with you know some people think I'm degrading the human animal but really I have the utmost respect for the human animal <laughs> and I just thought that was hilarious and I said <laughs> That's brilliant. I got it. I know what you did. I got it. So then to discover that the surrealist um, movement or art was you, you are an artist and it's, it's opened up my world. And one of my last questions was going to be, do you have any advice for a 50 something person who's sort of in a no man's land um, and stuck between, I, I can't stand inauthenticity, but um <laughs> But really, I think just ha spending this time with you today, you've answered all these things. You've inspired me. Um, and I told you the other day, I told uh, Melissa that is the other day that this, yeah. your other new book, yeah. can I get it right? Yeah. Um, I saw this and I didn't, I just, I thought it was more your paintings. It's it's really like letters and doodles and yeah. but this, well, this yes. title uh, made me, yeah. made me cry <laughs> and um i think it was just so poignant and i i'm 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 so grateful you've spent your time with me i wish we could do it again just maybe you'll squeeze me in sometime with all the okay. stuff you're doing I'll I'll leave it. <laughs> but um so we can we can say our bit our do for now with um oh, yes. our little, i've been making my way through mine <laughs> now it's your bikini <laughs> this is good. i've created a monster here thank yeah. you I don't know. We can't touch glasses, can we? No. <laughs> so actually, your bikinis turned into a thong. <laughs> Keep asking questions. <laughs> I will. I will. Um, have a a wonderful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> rest of your evening. I know you're just getting started because you're a night owl. Yes. Um, you're gonna paint or write or what? What I are you should, doing? I, I should be in my studio in a, in an hour or so time. I'll be working about four a.m wonderful well um so grateful so grateful and a um, huge pleasure thank you all right bye <laughs>
baby. Highly emotional, baby. 